my name's Caleb, and today I'm going to show you how to determine the speed of light with some marshmallows in the microwave. So as you can see here, we've got some marshmallows that are nice and evenly spread, and uh, we're going to be putting these in the microwave. And obviously they're going to melt, but certain spots are going to melt first, and there's a reason for that. Okay, so here goes. Okay, so I'm marking all the parts that are really gooey, which I noticed. See how the parts in here are not going to put these guys here really soft and gooey. We got three. Oh, that one there. The waves in a microwave act as superimposed waves, so they have nodes and antinodes. The molecules are then displaced and vibrate the fastest at the antinodes, making the marshmallow melt at these points first. Okay, so uh, right now I'm going to start measuring the distances between the center of these points. Um, first one we get about mm, 61 mil millimeters, 62 millimeters, sixty-six millimeters. Okay, so now we're going to be taking the average of uh, these uh, lengths, and that's half a wavelength. And just like it is in the graph, uh, there's a crest and a trough for every single wavelength. So each one of these represents half wavelength. So we're just going to double that now, and then that's the wavelength of my waves. So here we have the average of all the uh, distances between the points. Um, that equals um, half a wavelength, which is 0 0.063 meters. Um, now going up to here, we have the speed of light equals uh, frequency times uh, the wavelength. So we just now have to find the frequency, which we look up online and find for the model of the microwave. Okay, so since we uh, found this frequency of the model off the internet, we can now solve the C with um, the wavelength, which is 0 0.1, 2, 6, multiplied by 2.45 times 10, 9 hertz. And that turns out to be 3.087 times 10 to the power of 8 meters per second. And as you can see from this pretty crude experiment, we're only 2.9% off the actual speed of light, so it's pretty good for a job. And that, my friend, is how to calculate the speed of light with just a microwave and marshmallows.